Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the Extended Timeline. I'm your lovely host, Galvin. Alright. We're going to war for Lower Sin now. Byzantium, no. Aelanth, sure. Gassanids, yes. Lacanids, no. I don't even know where one of you are, and you're Byzantium, so I don't, I'm don't. i not surprised. But either way, storm the place, let's go. We know how this works by now. Alright. Either way... Yeah, I expected we'd win that. Oh, wow, we actually captured their trade ship. Suckers. Alright, one shock general. That might be... That's probably enough for them to win. But, we'll see. It's close. Oh, no, wait, we rolled... We rolled shitfully, as it were. Mm, that's fine. Doesn't matter that we lose. We just finish them off this way. Simple as that. And then they start recovering, and all is well. You know, is nice. Let's try and get this damn siege underway at least a little bit. Oh good, our leader with siege is actually on it now. Is Oh no, they both have siege. Didn't notice. Aw, Albania? Really? Mm -hmm. Alright, fair enough. Hey, uh, hey lands. Darn, I was gonna say. Gonna hope this. They could have taken out Albania. You know, I should have let them. Whatever. That's fine. They can they can just fucking sit there. I don't care. I'll get to them eventually. And besides, Sind is the war goal. <laughs> like, it is one of those, I really couldn't care uh, what you're doing up there. Because I'm capturing the war goal while you're sitting there doing that. Need I remind you? Uh... I don't suppose you're going to let me just uh, walk away with Sind, eh? Yeah, I didn't think so. Even if they take that, that's a limited portion of my nation, and they can't actually conquer anything else. So we're perfectly fine. Uh, we might as well go pick up the rest of the army. An extra 10,000 troops really wouldn't hurt. Uh, they have no navy left. So, it works. We, we can grab the army. Let's go. That seems like a terrible idea. You know, with three groups here, it's possible for us to continue sieging. We always need to have a group, you know, nearby on that. Alright, we'll storm up there. And we send the second group to do the same. Following the failure of the first group. There it is. A little late, but whatever. It doesn't matter. There. And that pushes them out of there. Perfect. The battles mean very little. Uh, 49 to 66. I don't have any interest in taking anything else, so we're good for now. If we can just win the uh, fight here. The non-possessor movement. Gain five patriarchal authority. Alright. Here's the relief team. Oh no, we lost a province. Oh no, they're going to send more troops in. We should be okay, I think. We should probably scramble. Though, just in case. Uh, 51 to 63. I've numbered them 2 to 1, and it's a close as hell battle. Hard to say. They also have cavalry, we don't, so that doesn't exactly help. <laughs> um, fucking Indians and their cavalry. Who needs horses? And horses suck. Alright, cool. We won. Oh no, they're heading for Kutch. That's okay then. I don't really care. 52-62. Okay. Alright, let's even up the army. Roman air draw from the lands. Sure. Cool. Fine by me. Ah yes, a national decision. Ah, oh, come on. Really? I swear I made that work. I'm actually opening, uh, you guys won't be able to see this on YouTube, but I'm fairly certain I opened it. This should work. Son of a bitch. Alright, well, I'm going to read off the uh, title and the description, uh, because apparently I can't code localizations for shit. <coughs> Here we are, the fall of Egyptus. The Roman province of Egyptus has fallen to rebellion. Many have fled south to us. Uh, 
I fucked up. Uh, says to us, they bring with them new schools of thought. It will be a bit of hard times for us to adopt them, but in the long run, it could be great for the well for the progress of our nation. Technology group changed Eastern, but lose seven stability. Do 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 do. That's okay. We'll totally take it. Uh, not terrible. Uh, basically, we adopt the uh, Roman, whatever the hell you call it, thingy. Uh, Roman tech group. Because the problem is we would never westernize otherwise. It's physically impossible. It's, that's the problem. Um, like, for us to westernize otherwise. Simply because there would be no western nation <laughs> that would ever touch us. Uh, and we'd do sub-Saharan for the rest of the game, so... It's Jack Roman Tech. That's basically the goal. <laughs> seven stability, yes. Seven stability meet is uh, basically a catch-all term for no matter what, even if you're at plus three, you end up at negative three. It's basically set stability to negative three. And... yeah. I right, relief team, get in there. We almost done. 53 to 59. Second relief team in there just in case. I didn't send them in at full strength. Good. Alright, cool. 53, 56. Alright. Tyrol has told us the end of the Peasants' War. Ah, yes, we can see Rome now. Or what remains of it, at least. Uh, hey, everyone. Meet Vesconia. Meet Navarra. Meet Galicia. <laughs> meet Greece, apparently. Uh, meet Algiers. Uh, I don't know how they held on to that. Libya? What the fuck are you doing here? Uh, I guess you're valid. Tripoli and Libya. You know, that makes sense. Um, Brigantes, Damoni, and Atriba have uh, divided up the British Isles. We apparently have the Netherlands, a barbarian tribe Netherlands. Because that's legit. Uh, Tyrol and Bavaria and Augsburg, a orthodox yeah, tribal despotism and a kingdom. Neat. Uh, that's an actual barbarian tribe. So yeah, everyone meet Gallia, our new France. <laughs> it's an empire. Oh, good lord. Also, people are saying, holy shit, I do see America. What the shit? I guess my sub-Saharan tech group or something? I don't know. Why the hell can I see America, though? I don't know. Either way, we can now see the Iroquois gigantic confederation of killing everything. <laughs> yeah, it's not too surprising that Greece came out here, but it, I just find it amusing that this is called Greece. Um... You know, as opposed to something else. Roman peasants, Illyrian patriots that are defecting to themselves. That sounds about right. That sounds completely correct in every way. Bunch of patriots down there and some peasantry. More patriots. Interesting. That Oh, that got converted to Roman. That's Celtiberian, so that could go. Roman peasants, yeah. Neat. So, uh, the Roman Empire has pretty much come apart. Byzantium's mostly intact. Um, everyone meet Osrone, the uh, this Jewish Mamluks, Libya, you know, all them. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, that's the remains of the Roman Empire, everybody. Not really all that surprising. Seriously, we're all fucked now. Look, look at this. This is Gallia, man. Oh, we're fucked. We're fucked. We're so fucked. Like, you thought France was bad. Just wait. That's gonna kill us all, man. 53, 54. Hey! Alright, we can take Lower Sin for ourselves now. Well, at least after the autosave, at least. Come on. Tick, tock, tick. 54, 53. Huzzah! We have lower sinned, everybody. 
adjacent to one of our encores, yeah. Well, this one we have a claim on, so it'll only take 57 months. Woohoo! As opposed to the 60. Alright. So, we've taken that part of the coast now, too. Woohoo! And we have a problem. Oh, do we have a problem? But I'm not going to deal with it right now, because... There should be... Aryan power title. Yeah, I need to fucking fix that. Um, so that's going to do it for this episode. Everyone meet the shattered remains of the Roman Empire. Well, who's that going to? Basque Patriots, so probably Visconia. Or Nevera. They're both Basque, I don't know. Could go to either or. Uh, yeah. So thank you everybody for watching. As always, this has been your lovely host, Galvin. Signing off.